All right, today we're gonna try something a little bit different. I'm gonna make some biscuits in my new zebra pot. I got the idea from Steve off of fireboxzoo.com and uh, he's got quite a few YouTube videos. I wanted to give it a try. We'll see what happens. Stay with me. So this is what I'm gonna be using. I put a uh, thermometer in here just uh, off a grill and uh, which is what Steve did. He's got a, a special thermometer. Uh, it seems like a good idea. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and add the rocks. One of the challenges that I had was trying to find a pot that when this is on its side can fit in there um, or a pan. I don't have one so I'm just going to use this uh, as something that we had and we'll give it a try. I don't know how. I'm going to put a couple biscuits in there and, and uh, see how that works. some of these coals on top get them out of here Get them a little more golden brown on top. So we're gonna put them back in. Put some more charcoal on top. Let's see what they look like. I didn't burn them. Oh yeah. Those look good. Let's see what the bottoms look like. Tip these over. Oh yeah. Perfect.
better. Oh yeah. So the stones, the stones in here are still piping hot. So to keep this warm, while I take it inside, I'm gonna throw it in there. Keep that bread nice and toasty. Well, thanks for watching. Uh, it took about, I would say, 20 minutes, uh, maybe a little bit more to do that. But I'll definitely do it again. It turned out good. It'd be nice for camping. I'm at home right now. I just wanted to try it out and see how it went. But uh, I wanted to thank Steve from uh, FireboxStove.com for the idea. And uh, I bought his, it was his zebra pot. I bought it off of Amazon. It's got the metal clips. And uh, those come in, come in real handy, so um, don't have to worry about them melting. The, the other ones have those plastic ones, so I appreciate the idea. And uh, hopefully one day I'll, I'll have one of one of Steve's stoves, so I appreciate it. Um, hit the like button and leave a comment. And also uh, subscribe if you haven't, I appreciate it. And uh, hopefully, hopefully you like the content. Thanks a lot.